Why do we blink so rarely sometimes? Today we are talking about blinking, its function and how to get rid of dry eyes. Let's go. So why is blinking so important? Blinking allows our eyes to be protected from dust and bacteria. Also it moisturizes our eyes and relaxes eye muscles and our psyche, our mind. So blinking is very important. Uh, why do we blink so rarely sometimes? Because blinking depends on our attention. If our attention is focused on reading or on working on PC, we start blinking rarely. So our task is to blink as often as possible. But what is the standard? What is the norm of normal blinking? So normally, according to the statistics, the, uh, the majority of people blink from uh, 15 to 25 times per minute. But according to the statistics, every fourth person is suffering from eye problems. So is it really good? Is it really enough? Of course not. So uh, the recommended number of blinking per minute starts from 30 and ends uh, at uh, 60. So from 30 to 60 it's okay. If you blink more than 60 it's too much. If you blink less than 30 it's not enough. To moisturize your eyes, to, to relax your eyes, your eye muscles. But how can we train blinking? It's very simple. Some people think that we cannot train it because it's, it happens uh, subconsciously. But in fact, if you try this simple technique that I'm going to show you, you will find it very effective. You will need just a pen. And then you create the rhythm. One beat per second, approximately. You can try it now. And while you are beating, you are looking around. It's not necessary to look like a robot. Look left, look right. I'm against of such techniques. They are completely unnatural. So what you should, where you should look at? You should look at the object that you are interested in. But the object could be everywhere. Up or down, doesn't matter. So you are training uh, your, your eyes naturally when you are looking around and just keep beating you will notice that it will speed up your blinking and it will happen naturally but don't try to blink on purpose because if you blink on purpose you will feel tired the muscle this muscle is getting tired and you will, will feel uncomfortable your blinking should be should be natural that's why you should just focus your attention on how you blink and when you're focusing your attention it happens automatically so you can use this technique every hour uh, when you're working on pc so every hour you have a break or every 50 minutes and you can look far and keep blinking uh, keep beating this is one um, option the other option you can read uh, so you can get a text uh, you can get a book or even you can read on, on your screen it's also okay and just keep beating This is also very useful for you because some people they are reading and they are saying what they are reading just uh, inside the, in their mind. So when you keep beating, you will read and you will process the information in, in a more effective way when you are getting used to it, of course. At the beginning it will be a little bit uh, complicated, but when you start practicing it and when you start reading and creating the rhythm, you will find it as a tool to speed up your reading as well. 
and to speed up the, the, the way how you process the information from reading. So this is very simple and this is very effective way how you can uh, train your blinking. But what, are also, what is also important about blinking? What is also important is if, whether you are blinking in a relaxed way or uh, you have some strain while you are blinking. For example, there is also so-called uh, double blinking. Like, And how can you find out if you have double blinking or not? You just uh, shoot yourself using your camera, your smartphone, and just check if your blinking is relaxed or not. If you have some uh, features of double blinking. But if you find out that you have double blinking, what should you do? You should relax your eyes. You should relax the eyelid muscles. You can do the relaxing wash, you should do other techniques that will um, accumulate more relaxation in your eyelid muscles. For example, palming, other exercises that we are practicing in the, at our um, Vision Academy classes. So if you are not sure if you are blinking uh, in a relaxed way or not, you can also share your video with me. You can contact me directly. Uh, send me by email or WhatsApp and I will tell you for sure if you're blinking uh, normally or not because it's very obvious when you're looking at someone from outside you can also share it with your friends or relatives if you like it I don't insist but if you would like to train not only your blinking if you would like not uh, if you would like not only to get rid of your dry eyes because it's obvious way how you can get rid of it instead of uh, using the pills and drops because using drops is useless so it's it's better it's much better to uh, train your uh, blinking because this is the main cause of dry eyes and you will forget about dry eyes very very soon but if you would like not only to get rid of dry eyes but also improve your vision then you will need to do other, uh, other techniques other practices as well other exercises and also you will need to train your healthy vision behavior that we actually training at our uh, online and live classes of uh, Vision Academy so you are very welcome to attend our open classes. Uh, you will find uh, the link uh, in, in the description for the video below. And if you like this video, please press on like. You can share it. Uh, you are very welcome to share it with your friends, with your relatives. Subscribe to our channel and uh, press on the bell not to miss the next video. Cheers.